Today we are going to do some continuous line drawing. We've been doing contour line drawings and continuous line could sort of be considered part of the contour line drawing family but with one definite difference and that a continuous line drawing, once your pencil is down on the page, you're not going to pick it off that page until you're done with the image, right? So it's one long fluid line that creates the image, okay? So what does that look like? Well, you did a do now that was a line drawing um, by Pablo Picasso, and it was of a woman's face. And that sort of looks like a continuous line drawing, but it's actually technically not, because you can actually see that there's some of her features are separate from, like for instance, her hair, or there's the one eye that that's out there separately from the rest of the face. So it's not really continuous line drawing. So let's take a look at this one. It's a horse. And so if you look at the horse, and if you put your finger on one end of that line, you could literally just take it the whole way through the image without stopping from one end of the line to the other. And that's a continuous line drawing. That's what we're looking for, right? That never picking up the pencil to create an image, okay? Now, I'm adding you the added um, kind of like another little curveball here is that you're gonna be drawing a self-portrait using continuous line. Why would I do this to you? Well, there's different reasons. First of all, if I'm gonna have you do a self-portrait, I'm not gonna have you do it in a way that would give you the expectations of getting a realistic drawing. Because I'll tell you what, drawing portraits is super difficult because we as human beings are programmed to recognize faces down to the teeniest little difference. So what I'm doing by doing this is I'm gonna take some of that off. There's no way you're gonna get a continuous line drawing that's gonna look exactly like your face and that's okay, right? So let go of that, that's not happening, right? This is just a way for you to really look at something and think about it as you're drawing because when you can't take your pencil off the page it really makes you plan ahead and think about how you're going to tackle that image and you might have to do it a bunch of times to kind of like oh i did this part first and i should have done that part first and you're gonna have to do it again and plan it in a different way so it's kind of it forces you to problem solve before you do that drawing and as you do that okay what are you going to need for this drawing you're going to need your sketchbook right out of your kit just draw grab a pencil and actually you could also dra um, grab um, a marker if you wanted to because for the continuous line drawing we're not going to be erasing if you mess up just start a new drawing okay because it's just going to be this idea because we don't want to be stopping and starting in a drawing so use your pencil if you want use your marker if you want you could use any colored marker if you want it doesn't matter because it's going to be as i said one continuous line drawing okay so you know what just to be fun I'm gonna grab a purple marker because I'm feeling like purple today. All right, so let's take a look. Oh, and can't forget this, don't forget your mirror. You need a mirror of some kind. So I've got this little mirror here. Any mirror at home will work, right? So you can look at your face as you're doing this. Okay, so I got my marker, my sketchbook, my mirror, right? All right, let's see how it looks when you start to tackle that drawing. All right, so I'm gonna situate myself in front of my mirror so I can see my face just fine. I need to tilt this so I can see. Okay, I've got my sketchbook ready to go, get my marker ready to go. And the first thing I need to do is decide where it is I wanna start. So for this one, I'm gonna start right at the eyebrow and go into the eye. Uh, this clip is sped up a little bit. It's about two times faster than regular time, so that's why it looks a little speedy. So you'll see that as I draw this, my marker does not lift off the page. No matter what part of the face I'm on, I'm just continuing the line that I started. I might back over and go back over a line back and forth a few times to kind of get from one area to another, but my marker does not come off the page. Even when I'm down here drawing the lips, you see that connector line to the chin so that the lips aren't floating around there. And I'll go back around here, I'm putting in the hairline and go back around the chin line again. And this is so that I can get back to the other side of the face and add in that final eye before finishing. Okay, so you're gonna do this continuous line drawing as many times as you think you need to. You could do it three, four, or five times. I've done it, what, three times now? So, but I could keep going. I could keep playing with this and seeing what I could come up with. Each time I've just started in a different place, I tried a different attack, you know, a different problem solving solution there to see what I could come up with. When you're done, when you feel like, all right, I've exhausted this, um, you're gonna, take a look at your sketches and you're going to star the one that you think is best so i thought this one was more interesting than my other two does it look more like me not particularly that's okay i just thought it was a more interesting drawing okay so i starred that one i want you to take pictures of each of your sketches right so if you have three there'll be three pictures if you have five there'll be five pictures 
If you have more than 10, let's not upload all of those. Why don't you pare it down? Let's, let's stick to five images. So if you did a whole bunch of them, pick five that you think are a little more interesting, star one of those five, upload those five images for today, okay? So, but you could have as little as three. I do want more than one. You should not be turning in just one sketch, okay? Because these are super quick drawings. So I'm expecting at least three continuous line drawings of your face to be uploaded, okay? So star the one you think is most interesting, most interesting Upload that to your assignment for Teams for today. All right, any questions, let me know. Have fun with this. It should be a silly kind of fun thing to do, okay?